everyone, and welcome to another Wellspring Early Years Program Virtual Circle Time. This week's theme is Crazy Colors. For our circle time today, you will need six pieces of paper and markers, crayons, or colored pencils in the primary colors, red, blue, and yellow, and the secondary colors, purple, orange, and green. Everyone, thanks for coming to another circle time. This week's theme is crazy colors. We're going to learn about all sorts of different colors and the different groups that they belong to. But before we get started, should we sing our hello song? Do you remember the four signs that go with it? Well, the first one is hello. The next one is friend with your two fingers. Make them hug. Good. The third sign is time. Point to your watch. And the fourth sign is say. Point to your mouth. So now we can sing our hello song. One, two, three. Hello, my friends. Hello, my friends. Hello, my friends. It's time to say hello. Hello! So, to get us started talking about some colors, I have a pretty funny book to read. It's really short, but very funny. Would you like to read it with me? Awesome. I'll go get it. Today's story is called Blue Hat, Green Hat by Sandra Boynton. Blue Hat, Green Hat, Red Hat. Oops! Look at that turkey! He's standing in his hat. What color is that silly turkey's hat? Yellow, that's right. Red shirt, blue shirt, yellow shirt. Oops! Ah, he's wearing a shirt on his legs. What color is that crazy turkey's shirt? Green, that's right. Yellow pants, red pants, green pants. Oops! My goodness, those pants are on his head. What color are those pants on his head? Blue, that's right. Blue coat. Oops! What color is that coat? Green, you're right. Red socks. Oops! They're on his hands. What color are those socks on the turkey's hands? Yellow, that's right. Green shoes, yellow shoes, blue shoes. Oops! It's on his head! What color is that shoe on the turkey's head? Red! That's right, red. Yellow hat, green shirt, blue pants, purple socks, red shoes. Oops! He's going swimming with all of his clothes on. What a crazy turkey. The end. So in our other circle time about weather, we learned about a bunch of colors when we drew our rainbow. And we know there are seven colors in a rainbow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. But there are even more colors that aren't in a rainbow like pink, which is my favorite color, black, lavender, teal, and more. Out of all of the colors, what are some of your favorites? Okay, that's a lot of different colors, but now I wanna teach you something neat about colors. Did you know that some colors are grouped together in families? Well, one of the groups of colors are called the primary colors, and these are the colors that can be mixed together to make any other color. There are three primary colors, and they are red, blue, and yellow. So now that we've learned about the three primary colors, how about we do a little bit of crafting with it? It only makes sense since it's color week. So for our first primary color, red, let's think of some red things that we could draw. We could draw a stop sign, a rose. Can you think of anything else? Those are good thoughts. What I did was draw an apple. See, I drew a red apple. You guys can draw whatever you want. So take your red marker and some paper, pause this video and draw something red. So our next primary color was blue. What are some blue things that are out there? Those are good things. I think of skies when I think of blue, 
or water. I think of blueberries. I love blueberries. So I chose to draw a raindrop though for my blue thing. So take your blue marker and some paper and you can color your blue thing. Okay, so our last primary color, do you remember what it is? That's right, yellow. What are some yellow things that are out there? Yes, that's right. There's bananas, the sun, lemons, all kinds of things. I chose to draw the sun for my yellow thing, but you can choose whatever yellow thing you want. So take your yellow marker and some paper and draw whatever yellow object you want. So now that we're sure that we remember all of our primary colors, I have a fun game for us to play. Do you know the song, If You're Happy and You Know It? It's a little bit like that song, but it's about if you're wearing a color. If you're wearing the color that the song says, you have to do what the song tells you to do, okay? So take a look at the colors you're wearing and be ready. One, two, three. If your clothes have any red, clap your hands. If your clothes have any red, clap your hands. If your clothes have any red, put your elbow on your head. If your clothes have any red, clap your hands. If your clothes have any blue, clap your hands. If your clothes have any blue, clap your hands. If your clothes have any blue, put your finger on your shoe. If your clothes have any blue, clap your hands. If your clothes have any yellow, clap your hands. If your clothes have any yellow, clap your hands. If your clothes have any yellow, wave and say hello. If your clothes have any yellow, clap your hands. Good job, everyone. That was an awesome job recognizing all of your primary colors. Really good work. So the other family of colors are called the secondary colors, and these are the colors that are made by mixing the different primary colors together. So the first secondary color is purple. Can you guess what colors you mix together to make purple? That's right, one of them is red. Can you guess what you mix with red? That's right, blue, and that's how you make purple, red and blue. The next secondary color is orange. What primary colors do you think mix together to make orange? Yellow and red. That's right. Yellow and red make orange. Lastly, there's green. What colors do you think you mix together to make green? That's right. Yellow and blue. Yellow and blue make green. So now we have all the secondary colors. Why don't we color some more things in our secondary colors? So we just learned about our secondary colors and one of them was purple. So let's think of some purple things. These are tricky to think of. What about an eggplant or cabbage or grapes? That's another good purple thing. Lavender, the flower is purple. So are some violets, they're sometimes purple. For my purple thing, I chose to draw some grapes. So, find your purple marker and color whatever purple thing you want. So, our next secondary color was green. Let's think of some green things. There's frogs. What about limes? There's a green light for go when you are driving. For my green thing, I chose to draw a line. So pick your green marker and color whatever green thing you want so that you can remember the color. Okay, and our last secondary color is orange. There's lots of orange things out there. Can you think of any? There's carrots, pumpkins. That's what I chose to draw, was a carrot. So you take your orange marker and you can draw whatever orange thing you want so that you can remember the color. Okay, now we've learned all of our primary colors, red, blue, and yellow, and all of our secondary colors, orange, purple, and green, 
I think we should sing a song so that we remember all of them. And I have just the song in mind. This song is called Six Little Crayons, and it has some dance moves, okay? So follow along and join me in this song. One, two, three. Six little crayons coloring a scene. Red, blue, yellow, purple, orange, green. Red said, look, I drew a smile. Now I'm going to go to bed for a while. Five little crayons coloring a scene. Blue, yellow, purple, orange, and green. Blue said, I drew my ocean so quick. Now I'm going to go for a dip. Four little crayons coloring a scene. Yellow, purple, orange, and green. Look, said yellow, my sun's so bright. Now I'm going to go and bask in the light. Three little crayons coloring a scene. Orange, purple, and there's green. Orange says, look, I drew some cheese. Now I'm gonna go and eat some, please. Two little crayons coloring a scene. Purple first and then there's green. Purple says, hey, I drew a grape, but I'd better go or else I'll be late. One little crayon coloring a scene. Sitting all alone was Mr. Green. As he drew some little frogs, back came all his friends to sing some songs. Good job, everyone. That's a long song, and thanks for doing the actions along with me. So now we've learned about a whole bunch of different colors. We've sang some songs together. I would like to read with you one of my favorite books that talks about colors. It's pretty short, but you might know it. It's called Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? I'll go get the book so that I can read it to you. This story is called Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? by Bill Martin Jr. with illustrations by Eric Carle. Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? I see a red bird looking at me. Red bird, red bird, what do you see? I see a yellow duck looking at me. Yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? I see a blue horse looking at me. Blue horse, blue horse, what do you see? I see a green frog looking at me. Green frog, green frog, what do you see? I see a purple cat looking at me. Purple cat, purple cat, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. White dog, white dog, what do you see? I see a black sheep looking at me. Black sheep, black sheep, what do you see? I see a goldfish looking at me. Goldfish, goldfish, what do you see? I see a teacher looking at me. Teacher, teacher, what do you see? I see children looking at me. Children, children, what do you see? We see a brown bear, a red bird, a yellow duck, a blue horse, a green frog, a purple cat, a white dog, a black sheep, a goldfish, and a teacher looking at us. That's what we see. The end. Okay, everyone, that pretty much wraps up circle time for today, but thank you for joining me. Make sure that you keep an eye on our YouTube channel because tomorrow we'll be posting another parenting workshop, this time about the importance of play. And next week, our circle time theme is growing gardens, so that will be very exciting. But before we wrap up, should we sing our goodbye song? Do you remember it? Awesome. The sign for goodbye is like this. Goodbye. So let's sing our song. One, two, three. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, my friends. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, everyone. See you next week. Thanks for coming to another Wellspring Early Years program circle time. If you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up 
and subscribe to make sure that you catch all of the Circle Time videos and parenting workshops posted on our YouTube channel. See you next time!